Good afternoon, friends. I am here at CVS getting ready to do my weekly couponing. Before I head in store, I want to announce that I am going to do another $10 gift card giveaway. If you would like to enter, like this video, comment below, any comment at all, and make sure that you're subscribed to my channel. Well, I'm going to head in now. My first stop is at the CVS Redbox. I type in my number. I typed it in three times and it still popped out CRT. So I actually scanned my card on my phone for the last time and got additional CRTs. The Maybelline Instant Coupon that printed out for me at the Redbox is 8 off 40 and I won't be using this CRT. The first deal that I'm going to do is very simple. It's buy one Sure deodorant for $2 and get $2 in extra care bucks back. This is a great deal for beginners or anyone who hasn't gotten their CRTs back. The next deal that I'm going to do is on the Nivea Men Shave products. This week, they're on promotion for buy two and get a $5 extra care buck back. I'm going to pick up two of the men's shave gel. They're priced at $4.59 each, so they'll total me $9.18. We also have a rebate on Ibotta for $1.20 back. And since I've purchased Nivea men's shave products before, I will also hit a $0.75 cent bonus. I'm going to use this $2 off two paper coupon. So I'll pay $7.18 at the register, but get back that $5 extra care buck in addition to $3.15 on Ibotta, making this a $0.97 cent money maker. Next, I'm going to pick up some L'Oreal Revitalift. It's part of the Spend 30, Get a $10 Extra Buck deal. It's not tagged in my store, but I can see from the ad that any L'Oreal facial care is included. I'm going to pick up this eye cream priced at $19.49 and use two $6 off L'Oreal Revitalift CRTs and a $5 off 15 L'Oreal Facial Care CRT. Those CRTs will take $12 off, leaving me to pay $2.49. I'm looking for some scent beads, but unfortunately it seems that my store is all cleared out of the ones that are a part of the Spend 30 deal. And it looks like the tide is all cleared out as well. I've never seen the laundry shelves this bare at my CVS before. And then I spot the Tide Free and Gentle. It's a part of the Spend 30 deal. It's priced at $11.94 and I'm going to use this $3 off paper coupon. After the paper coupon, it will be $8.94. This is the kind of detergent that I use on my toddler's clothes, so I'm happy to pick it up. This is my complete Spend 30 deal. These two products total $31.43, but after my paper coupon and CRTs, I'll pay $11.43 and get back $10 in extra care bucks. This week, L'Oreal Cosmetics are on promotion for when you spend 15, you'll get a $5 extra care buck back. I'm going to pick up the Lash Serum price at $15.79, and I got the last one. I've never tried this before, so I'm excited to pick up something new. I have several CRTs for this product. I have two $3 off Lash Serum and then one $3 off $15 in Cosmetics CRT. I'm able to stack all of these CRTs because the only threshold listed is $15, and this product is over $15, so I have met that threshold. These CRTs will take off $9, leaving me to pay $6.79 and getting back $5 in extra care bucks. Next, I'm going to pick up some Revlon. It's on promotion for spend $12 and you'll get $4 in extra care bucks back. And this promotion has a limit of six. I'm going to do this deal twice. The first thing that I'm going to pick up is this blush priced at $12.49. I think that this is a pretty good color. I've already hit the $12 spend once, but I'm going to do this promotion twice, so I need to pick up another product. I'm going to pick up an eyeshadow kit priced at $11.79. These two products will total me $24.28. Since I've spent $12 twice, I'll get back $8 in extra bucks for this transaction. I have some paper coupons and a CRT that will lower my out-of-pocket cost. I have a paper coupon for $4 off any face and $3 off any eye. These are from our most recent Smart Source insert. I also have a $5 off 20 Revlon Cosmetics CRT. After the coupons and CRT, I'll pay $12.28 and get back that $8 in extra care bucks. So my cost for the Revlon will be $4.28 or $2.14 per product. 
However, I have spent $59.56 between all of these beauty products that I'm purchasing. That means that I will almost hit beauty twice just from these products and get back $6 in extra care bucks. Do you guys remember when I left that CoverGirl lip coupon here last week? Well, I just checked and as you can see, it is still here. This coupon expired on the 30th, so I'm going to go ahead and take it down. Next, I'm going to pick up some CVS Health Baby Wipes. They're priced at $2.89, and I have an app-only coupon for $2 off. That will make them $0.89 cents after coupon. This little pack will be convenient to keep in my purse for my toddler when she's eating on the go and has a little messy face. Next, I'm going to pick up some of these CVS Health Panty Liners. My store isn't marked, but they are buy one, get one half off. The first one will be $1.39 and the second one will be $0.69. Cents. The two of them will total $2.08, but I have a $2 off app only coupon, so I'll pay just $0.08 cents for both. There's also a rebate on Ibotta for $0.10 cents back that will actually make these panty liners a $0.02 cent money maker. I wanted to pick up the Total Home Tissues again. I have this CRT for $2 off, but unfortunately the shelf is empty in my store, so I'll have to pick them up next week. Hopefully they'll get more in stock. Do you guys remember when I bought those Christmas earrings at 75% off? Well, it looks like I should have waited because they are still here. Guys, I have stood in this aisle and debated doing this deal because it's going to be a cost, but it is something that I actually need. I use these electric toothbrushes and I need some replacement heads, so I'm going to go ahead and do this deal. Select Oral-B is on promotion this week for spend $12 and get $4 in extra care bucks back. I'm going to grab an electric toothbrush in addition to these replacement heads. These two will total me $13.98. I'm gonna add this gum repair expensive toothpaste to my transaction. These are also priced at $6.99 and on promotion when you spend $12, you'll get $4 in extra care bucks back. These four products will total me $27.96, but I have a $2 off paper coupon on the toothbrush and two $3 off coupons on the toothpaste. I also have a four off 20 CRT for Crest, Scope, and Oral-B. So I will pay $15.96, but get back $8 in extra care bucks. I give away a lot of toothpaste, but I am going to save these products for myself. The last deal that I'm going to do today is on the Garnier Facial Care. It's on promotion for buy two and get a $5 extra care buck back. I really want these reusable cleansing pads, and I'm also going to pick up some makeup remover wipes. I have two $2 off CRTs on Garnier Micellar Water and a 40% off CRT on Garnier Skin Care. These two products will total me $16.58. After those two $2 off CRTs, that will bring it down to $12.58. 40% of that will come off, which is $5.03, bringing my total to $7.55 that I will pay and I'll get back $5 in extra care bucks. I know from my receipt from last week that I was $15 away from hitting beauty, so I will also hit beauty and get $3 back in beauty bucks. This is everything that I'm picking up today. I know that I will have a final cost, but that's okay because I'm excited to pick up new products and things that I wanted and things that I actually really needed. I'm back home. This is everything that I picked up today. I'm excited because I picked up several items that I have never picked up before at CVS, like this lash serum right here. I'm excited to try this and I'm really excited to have these reusable um, makeup remover pads. So this is $132.19 worth of products and that is the sale price. Let me go ahead and show you my receipt. So there's the Tide, the Sure, the Crest toothpaste, the Oral-B toothbrush and replacement heads, the panty liners, the Revlon, the L'Oreal Lash Serum, the L'Oreal Eye Cream, and the Baby Wipes. So my Tide coupon came off, my Oral-B coupon came off, my Revlon coupons came off, um, and then these two coupons down here are for the Crest toothpaste. Wait a minute. Tide Oral-B 
Revlon Crest toothpaste, and then I, that must be the Nivea coupon. I don't think I had another $2 paper coupon. I did not. For some reason that Nivea coupon came off even though he voided the Nivea off. What happened was I had an $8 extra care buck that was not working. So instead of having uh, my cashier re-ring my entire transaction, I told him to just take the Nivea off and I would do that separately. But as you can see, what ended up happening was the $8 did come off. And then I had a $3 extra buck lower itself down. My subtotal was zero and I had a $2 and a $1 extra care buck that were not used that he gave back to me. So <laughs> that's rather odd that the coupon still went through. That's really weird because I'm looking at this and I did not have another $2 paper coupon besides the Nivea. That's really odd, you guys. That's really odd. Um, and then I did use that coupon over here when I rang it up separately. So I ended up handing over, I handed over $44 in extra care bucks. That $3 extra buck lower itself down and I got back $3 in extra care bucks. So this ended up being $41 in extra care bucks that I spent. Plus my care pass, which I only pay $5 a month for. So as you can see, I saved 100% on this transaction and they said that the retail value is $120.17. Um, and then for Beauty Club, I only needed $14.83 to hit beauty. I got back $4 for the Crest toothpaste, $10 for the Spend 30 deal, $8 for the Revlon, $5 for L'Oreal, $4 for the Oral-B, and $2 for the Sure, and then some coupons. So then I had already planned to do the Garnier separately because I had that percentage off coupon. And if you've ever used percentage off coupons at CVS, you know that it takes the percentage off after coupons. And since extra care bucks are counted in their system as coupons, it will only take off, you know, whatever percentage after extra care bucks. So you don't want to use extra care bucks with percentage off coupons. And since I had that money card from last week, I ended up using that. So my two $2 off Garnier um, CRTs came off in the 40%. So my subtotal was $7.54. I used my money card on that one. And then I got back $5 in extra care bucks on this. For the Garnier deal, I got back $5, but I rolled that into my next transaction, which was the Nivea. So the Nivea Shave Gel, and then I had that $2 off paper coupon that they gave back to me which apparently got counted twice, <laughs> unfortunately. And then I handed over $7 in extra care bucks. I paid 18 cents in cash subtotal. And then I got back $5. And then I also got back, um, what did I get back from <laughs> Ibotta? A dollar and 20 cents for each of the shave gels. And then I got 75 cents for the Nivea bonus because I've previously purchased Nivea men's products before. And I also got back 10 cents on Ibotta for the panty liners. And on Fetch, I got back 10 cents between all of my receipts. Be sure to scan all of your receipts into Fetch because you never know what it will pick up. It gave me five cents for this L'Oreal Lash Serum. So overall, I spent $60.72 between extra care bucks, gift card, and um, I paid 18 cents subtotal in change. <laughs> so what I got back was $43 in extra care bucks, and I only needed $14.83 $14 to hit beauty. 
and I spent $76.14 in beauty. So I'll hit beauty three times in this transaction and get back a $9 beauty buck within 48 hours. I also got back $3.25 on Ibotta and I got back 10 cents on Fetch. So in total, everything that I got back was $55.35. So that makes this transaction a final cost of $5.37, which I think is incredible because the value of all of these products is $132.19 on sale. And I got stuff that I really wanted. Like I really needed these, you guys, these replacement heads, and I wanted this and this. And I will probably use this eye cream as well. I'll probably try that. So I think that it was a great transaction for me. And you know, it, it keeps things interesting when we get to pick up new things. <laughs> Don't forget to enter the giveaway. And if you enjoyed this video, please give it a thumbs up and subscribe if you haven't already. And as always, thank you for watching.